redemption box since I had a really good one and a really bad one. I gotta, I gotta have a redemption one so I can just put Ben in his place with Commander Legends. Everything so. on this kitchen table is not your domain. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta, I gotta look Ben in the eye. Tell him I'm the Commander Legend here. <laughs> All right. Enjoy being the Commander Legend. I'll be Ben. I like being Ben. Sounds awful. Way too much green. So I guess, I guess the question at this point is, do I do we, like kale. <laughs> do, 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 I, do I get a Ben box or do I get my box? Because we seem to have definitely themed boxes of heavy green or heavy blue. Uh, true Benjaminism has never been tried. <laughs> Alright, so we'll, we are still looking Mind for the blown. Jewel Lotus, because that's the only Chase Mythic we have not pulled. Alright. Golem Artist. Demonic Lore. Blasphemous Act. Hey, that's the first one. Yeah! That we pulled. Nice. Uh, Flush nice. Sculptor. The Modi. And we don't care about any of that. Yeah, we, we got Blasphemous Act. It's the only thing that matters. Yeah, the chase rare. <laughs> I mean, it works really well with the new uh, blue legendary. It's like, oh yeah, blast sack the board. Cool, I'll draw 13 cards. It's like, oh, maybe that was a mistake. Right. Vow of Flights, Monstrous Onslaught, Slot of the Strong. What is that? Nightshade Harvester. 2-2 two, two, for a black and three elf shaman. Whenever a land enters the battlefield under your opponent's control, that player loses one life. And we'll put a plus a plus one counter on Night Shade Harvester. Ooh. All right. I like that. That's very cool. It's a very anti-acceleration. Has them. And ooh, a foil, Thorn of the Black Rose, and Storm Crow. Of course. What's, what's a box without some Storm Crows? I mean, the average seems to be four. No one's pulled the Mythical Five. That's just what we're calling it. <laughs> the, the Storm Crow. The side. Prismatic Piper. Hey, oh. Return to Dust. Uh, well, comments, comments, Jessica's will, well, which it is. Uh, so the commander clause, uh, add a red for each card and target opponent's hand, exile top of the cards of your library, you may play them uh, this turn. Hmm. That one is actually, I think it's the most expensive will, currently. Really? Yes. Hey, Kodama the East Tree, our first one, and this is definitely a Ben card. Uh. It's a 6 6 for 2 green and 4 reach whenever another permanent enters the battlefield under your control. If it wasn't put on the battlefield with this ability, you may put a permanent card with equal or lesser converted mana cost from your hand onto the battlefield. I don't know, man. I think my tastes have changed. <laughs> I, I saw that card and I'm actually not a fan. What? You don't like free extra permanence? I think it does too much. <laughs> I think right. it does too much. Uh, like I, I'm a lot more in favor of uh, chaos and randomness than I am just, just like a value engine. <laughs> or just beat face. Victimize. Lore Seeker Stone. Hey! hey we're first, spring. That's the first blue and blue and green one. Nice! Hey! The Moon Kraken. Yes, Emrakul's Tentacle. Yep, and Faithless. Ooh, and an etched Tormod Desecrator. Nice. Hey. Another fetched foil. Right? Right. All right, so I got, I got to get at least like four in this box since uh, my second box had zero super feel bad. Mm. We'll see. We'll see. I mean, I guess, you know, like another etched mythic would also be also be acceptable. For the viewers, I'll first response, scaled behemoth, plague reaver. It's so a six five for a black and two. Begin of your end step. Sacrifice each other creature you control. Wow. Discard two cards. Sack Reaver. Choose target opponent. Return Plague Reaver to the battlefield under that player's control at the beginning of the next upkeep. <laughs> I love, see, I love a card like this. This is amazing. <laughs> I, I would play the crap Just, out of that. Card. Oh, that, that's a big board. It'd be a shame if a Plague Reaver ate it all. Uh, that's Rumi and a foil uh, spell capture. It, it's got some interesting costs and it's got some fun abilities. It, it, it's cheaply costed. Mm -hmm. That's I was like three for a six five. Like if it's your only creature, oh no, I sack all my other ones. Okay, they're sacked. Yeah. <laughs> uh, terrible gorilla, not foil. <laughs> Correct. It's not foil. Therefore, it's terrible. <laughs> and like armaments. Good old confiscates, which is ooh, and a port razor. 
When a report razor deals damage to a player, untap each creature you control after this combat phase, resistant combat phase. Port razor can't attack a player that has already been attacked this turn. So he can't attack the same player, but all the other creatures can. Gross. So first mythic. And then so breaches, brazen plunderer. Ooh, the feel. That's our first one. It's our first one. So it's a 2-2 two, two for a two white and a green life link. Begin of each end step. If you gain life this turn, distribute up to that many plus a plus one cameras among any number of other target creatures. You would, you unicorn. And a foil maelstrom colossus. I'm hey. gonna... It's amazing. Yeah. I was like the the uh, the unicorn there. I'm like, oh, and a life gain deck. Oh, I gain ten life. Distribute ten plus yeah, one plus one cameras. Put that in a, in a white loss deck. Maybe. Right. Good old preordain, right up front. I think we only had one pack of the preordain was not just right up front. Same. Same season. Alright. Volcanic Dragon. Cyberstorm. 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 Oh, Dreamstone Hedron. And a War Room. So it's land, tap, Ediculus. Three, tap, pay life, good number of colors in your commander's color identity, draw a card. Interesting. Huh. I like it. So, right? three, tap, draw a card in a mud deck. I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Uh, old, good old Wolfie. Yeah, uh, Power Stone Engineer. Ooh, and a foil Ooh. training center. That is. That's beautiful. That's nice. Happy about that foil rare. I mean, it's no uh, hole breacher or opposition agent, but you know what? You, you know what I want from this box? I want a full out card. Tired of, tired of Ben just being all this little is high it, stool over is there. Is it just the planeswalkers that are full art? No, there's others that can be full art as well. Because we only pulled planeswalkers. At least it's we. He only pulled planeswalkers. You're right. It was me. <laughs> Warcraft Judge. Now it is Nightblade. And a Horizon Stone. A Radiant Sarah. Ooh! Neverall. And a Foil Ghastly Demise. Hey, Popper players, rejoice. <laughs> you know who you are. <laughs> no, uh. <laughs> Alright, so one mythic out of that first deck. I mean, I sure do. I know who I am, popper player. I popper so hard that I spend money on it. But not a whole lot, because it's popper. No. Well, no. you spend a whole lot on it. Yes. <laughs> Alright, skilled animator. Open the armory. Patron of the Valiant. And a Rakasha Debaser. For a 6 6 for a 4 or, uh, for 2 black, 4 color 6 6. Whenever it attacks, put target creature card from defending player's graveyard onto the battlefield under your control. Looks like a Johnny gone bad. Yeah, uh, and the thing is that like that creature stays there. It doesn't get sacked at the end of turn, so it's real good. Linra Rebecca. Ooh, and a Foil Lisa, Shroud of Dusk. Very a cool. Second. And a rock! And yes, we got a rock! Our, our second foil rare. Yeah, but you got a rock, so that's great. <laughs> <laughs> that, man, the text on, let's look at this, the text on this is super faded. Oh, like, I told you, man, it's all the alcohol. Man, like, looks like it just like sat in the sun for a week. It's faded out the text. Good old murder. Getting away with. Mindless Automaton, Rex Age, Hero's Blade, and yeah. Wrong Turn. Yeah, Wrong Turn. Heck yeah. Uh, Ragarth. Oh, Blim. 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 Ooh, and a Foil Opal Palace. And another foils. Rock. Yes! You're getting some neat foils and I tokens. am. <laughs> oh man, I'm hoping that I pull. Oh, I, guess, I guess I did pull the Foil Mythic possibly for this case with that Sakashima mm -hmm. Imposter etched. But I'm going to hope there's another one that holds a jeweled lotus. You would. You would hope. I would hope. Burning Anger. Scholar of the Ages. Feast of Succession. Ooh, it's a mythic. Mm. It's a mythic. Scroll Rack! Hey! Nice. Hey! hey uh, I am definitely okay with the Scroll Rack. Kangi. Arden. And a foil Hamza Ooh. Guardian. You're gonna have to message that, that individual and see if they want foil ones. Yeah. Oh. 
That's a very cool score. Right? It's been a while since I've seen that card. I, that, I think that I throw the, I just realized that is now the only Chase Mythic we are missing is uh, that Jeweled Lotus, which hopefully is in this box so I can just point and laugh at Ben. Because mm. I got most of the Chase Mythics. Why would, why would you want to point and laugh at me? Because it's fun. Point and laugh at ending is fun. Ah, okay. Conjures Lieutenant, Arcane Signet, Volcanic Torrent, Promise of Tomorrow. Enchantment for a white and two. Whenever a creature you control dies, exile it. Begin of each end step. If you control no creatures, sacrifice Promise of Tomorrow and turn all cards exiled with it to the battlefield under your control. Wow. Oh. Wow. Gross. <laughs> Kedis. Jared. 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 And Foil Gerard. Murder. Jared the Handsome. <laughs> <laughs> Gerard, the, Gerard the buff. Yeah, right? <laughs> uh, all right. Open something good. You've already opened something good. Oh, yeah. Open something else good. I'm trying. Humble Defector. Imperious Perfect. Court of Ambition. Well, uh, that's is that good. Well? It is no. not. Okay. Uh. Warning, full nice. filigree. Filigree. Filigree All right. familiar. All right, so just past the halfway point. Only two mythics so far. I think I think we're averaging five per box. I want to say it's close to that, yeah. So there's there's potential. Trip to the signs, revenant, brass herald. Coercive Recruiter. This is the new Zealous Conscripts, quote unquote. Mm. So whenever a recruiter or another pirate enters the battlefield under your control, gain control of target creature until end of turn. Untap that creature to end of turn. It gains haste and becomes a pirate. Districts of types. So it, it can all combos with Kiki Jiki. It also combos with other pirates. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Hey, my first Hans. Nice. Well, Ooh, is oh, Becca. Is that foil? This is not. No. Group Chronologist. This is the command that people have been talking about a lot. This command in particular has made a lot of cards shoot up in price. It's for Grixis in one, it's a 3-4. The player whose turn it is may end the turn. Do you know why this card has made so many things shoot up in price? Because all of the end turn, like, take its turn effects, you're like, nope, I don't lose the game. Put that trigger on the stack. It's yeah. like, oh. It's very good. And a foil guilt leaf winnower. That's like very interesting the card. what the the two red take extra turn after that you lose the game I think I know it's from like seven that card went from like two dollars to like thirty overnight when she got spoiled good old preordain good old command tower all right tangible virtue codex shredder splider. And a Chroma's Will! I'm... Deuce! Like, yeah, like, I can't believe that card's an instant. It's just like, ugh. Ooh, Zara, Renegade Recruiter. For is it and three, flying 4-3 whenever Zara attacks. Look at defending player's hand. You may put a creature card from it on the battlefield under your control. Tap and attack, and that player will play its rocket they control. Turn the creature to do anything. Jesus. That's really freaking good. Oh my god, that's, that's scary. Mm-hmm. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Attack you. Oh, that's a, that's a nice 15-15 worm you have in your hand. It'd be a shame if it hit you. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's very powerful, but I, I would consider a fun card. Oh, yeah. I mean, because that, that one's like very dependent on the power level of your opponent's deck. Mm -hmm. So Mace, Pride of the Perfect. Mask of Memory, and a Magus of the Order. Very cool. All right. Jury, Tormod, and a Foil Charcoal Diamond. All right. Cool. All right. Last deck. Three Mythics. Jeez, Gordon. I'm asking You're a lot. Pace. I know. Why aren't you, like, double pace? Come on. I'm trying. I mean, they know I only want the blue ones, so they're like, nope. Fencing Ace, Hunter's Insight, that's a rare. Ah, Necrotic Hex, all right. I have no response to Necrotic Togo, Hex. Togo, Tuya, 
Halo Arcade Signet. That's cool. Yeah. And Stormcrow. Stormcrow. Oh. Very nice. I'm actually surprised with my my foil slots. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not, it's not, as, good as, a, not as good as Sakashima or a, a Rings, but I'm still very impressed with my foil slots. Very solid indeed. Sky Diamond, Marauder. Getting away with Sky Diamond. Burnished Hearts. Merchant Traders. Three visits. Everwild Captain. Alright. It's like Elena. Gore. And a Staunch Throne Guard, Sam. Come on. My double mythic pack. I've seen Ben do it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can do it too. I want you to do it. I believe in me. I believe in toast. <laughs> you are not toast. I'm not toast. Oh no. Vow of Lightning. Supreme Will. Meteor Goal. Oh, it's a myth. Oh. <gasps> I think I know what this is. Sphinx of the Second Sun. Did you guess correctly? I did. Yeah, I, yeah. I saw the stats at the bottom. I was like, <gasps> So it is a 6-6 six, six for 2 blue and 6 flying. At the beginning of your post-combat main phase, you get an additional beginning phase after this phase, which means you begin, uh, you get the untap, upkeep, and draw steps. So you get additional upkeep effects, you get an untap step, and an additional draw step, which is like, woo! I don't like that card. <laughs> I like that card a lot. It's a very blue card. Kellith, and a foil raise the alarm. I hate the armor card. It's, it's like it's like Man Bear Sphinx. It's fine. It's all blurry. <laughs> there it goes. Man. See? Man Bear Sphinx. Not a fan. <laughs> this doesn't jive with me for some reason. I can't quite put my finger on it. All right, Al Gore. It's not Man Bear Pig. It's Man Bear Sphinx. Got to got to tear him down. All right, Advocist, cast down. War Gear, Inno Sakashima, Sakashima Will, Master Smith, Ooh, the Lavoyo Osworn Sentinel, and a. So when Sakashima dies, who's he giving all his stuff to? Or she? I don't know what the gender of Sakashima is. Oh God! I see. I was not. I was not really playing during the. Uh, the bad block. Yeah, the Kamigawa. <laughs> the Kamigawa block. So I don't really know the lore of that one. I would assume it's, um, I can't think of her name. The one that actually is in the uh, the makeup. And I'm blanking on what it's actually called. Uh, Coastline Marauders, Sandstone, or, ooh, it's a green mythic. It's not a creature, so I actually don't know what this is. Reshape the, oh God, reshape the earth. Oh. It, this is the only one we haven't pulled yet. Yeah, from, from so cycle. three green and six, search your library to ten land cards, put them on a battlefield tap, then shuffle your library. Nice. So, Volakut decks, rejoice. Right. Uh, Violation of Landwar, Prava, IV, Foil, and our fourth. So, I know we opened the white one, the blue one, the black one, and the green one. Have we opened a red one? I don't believe so. Okay. I don't know what the red one does either. I don't remember what the red one does. It's okay, I'll get it in my box. Uh, probably. <laughs> All right. Ambush Viper, heck yeah. It, it kills. It, it kills Colossus. You're right. Thirst for knowledge. Guilt to leave winnower. Strength the pack. Immaculate Magistrate. I mean, it's good in the elf deck. Mm -hmm. Armix. Malcolm. In the middle of betrayal. Come in the middle of these Two packs pirate. left. Alright. One more with it. Come on, box. Th does it seem fitting that the pirate's name is Malcolm? You're not the boss of me now. Pirate. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's a navigator, so I mean, it makes sense. Make a stand. Pen and blade. Frenzied saddle brute. And a court of cunning. An adir. A coin and a foil quarter All right. Foil quartz. Last bet. Come on, Mythic. Let me average that five. Mm -mm. I did I did get yeah, I did, and I did get an etched in this one. Yeah, you got the Tormod. Yeah. So a second etched in this one. Just make that one box a real weird anomaly. Come on. Alright. 
Okay, we recruit Thought Vessel, Night Blade. Oh, that's a rare. Armored Sky Hunter. Felice, Hannah, and Elvish Doomsayer. All right. Womp. Womp. All right, so it's up to Ben. At least you got the Salamander token. I did. It's up to Ben to find that Jeweled Lotus in that last box, hopefully. So that was a five mythic box? That was a four mythic box. Right? We are one short. 